Greetings, everybody. I am Lobo, and welcome back to Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. Today, we're headed back to the Citadel. Because of that, I spent some time in between episodes scouring the galaxy for all this stuff that we need to turn in at the Citadel to hopefully clear out this journal a little bit. So, let's go do it. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I'll handle it. Yes, Commander. Hey there. Okay. Hello, Torians have both agreed to okay? Have Anyone been bothering you? No, it's not that. I'm fine. Ah, uh, I see. So, any news? No, they just... Their shuttle must be real Bruce slow. That's all. Do you think they're okay? They promised they'd come and get me, no matter what they had to do. But it's been so long. I don't know, kid. I'm sure they'd be happy knowing you're safe. It's just... I miss them. I miss them so much. Uh, here's one of our guys. Hey, fella. Got something for you. I found a Prothean Sphere on Gehinnom. Contact the Alliance and tell them Commander Shepard asked them to pay you for it. Yes, thank you. About I'll time. call them right now. Yeah, no problem. That's what I do. Thank you, Commander. I've gotten food for my family. And for some of the others who were trapped here, too. Nice. Very nice. Thank you, Vega. Oh, hey, big fella. I recovered the Code of the Ancients from Dakuna. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. With shock and joy. Really, this is wonderful news. Thank you, human. Sincerely, this will greatly aid our people. Hey, look me in the face when you thank me. With sincere gratitude. Thank you, human. Yeah, no problem. No problem. You need to brush your teeth, though. Anyhow, enough about my armor. Let's find the gang and celebrate while I'm still here. Where'd you park? I took rapid transit. Come on, you have the fanciest ride on the Citadel. And I saw that new paint job. I, uh, I sold it a couple of weeks ago. What? But you love that car. I know. You never shut up about that car. I know. Yeah, well, you know, when times get tough, there are higher priorities in your vehicle. As much as that pains me to say. What the hell's your problem? I'm not skinning the Alliance. Well, since when are you so chummy with those pricks? Screw you. You've been watching the news? Sure. Know what's happening to Earth while we're sitting here? Calm down already. Excuse me. I recovered the rings of a loon. They're waiting in Bay D24. That's wonderful. Thank you. My people will treat this miraculous find as a call to support their local hospitals. Yeah, you're welcome. Yes, I'm seeing increased turnout as well. We may actually make it through this war. Ah, here's open. Actually, I found a Cacleosaur skull preserved in amber. Maybe you could clone it, or... You're kidding? You're kidding? Seriously? Well, um, if, if the genetic material is intact, we could... Hmm, well, we've got cloning facilities on Sarkesh. Cacleosaur genes were remarkably pliable. Cloning might be effective. What are you talking about might be? That means nobody's gonna contradict me real quick. I can guarantee you it will be. Really? And they're already riding the first units into battle? Well, that's... that's great. No, no, don't worry about that. It's how Cacleosaurs mark territory, and the Krogan don't seem to mind. Are they peeing on them? Hey, you know, that aside, that aside. You see my, my scientific expertise on full display here. Hey, Talizora! Of course. We can have ships at the colony in 36 hours. Do you need medical support? No, evacuating the colony is more than enough. Thank you, Ambassador. Ambassador? I'm coordinating actions for the fleet while we're here. Evacuating colonies, bolstering Turian defense lines. Huh. I think it was right here. Three years ago to the day. What? This was where Saren's assassins fired at me. I'd just gotten to the Citadel. I didn't think I needed my barriers up. My mistake. 
Saren had assassins after you? Right. I disabled the Geth and found that recording that proved he was working with the Reapers. I went to Ilium and tried to inform the authorities, but Saren's mercenaries attacked me. I barely escaped. I stowed away on a Turian freighter and came out here. I thought I was safe. You never told me about this. How bad was it? Got me in the arm. They used polonium rounds. I was running a fever in minutes. It was the first time I'd been really hurt on my pilgrimage. I ran to the council embassy, asked for protection, offered the data on Seren. The Turian clerk called me Suit Rat. He threatened to have me tossed off the station if I didn't leave. I wish that clerk could see you now. He just did. That was him back there. I don't think he remembers me. A scumbag. You know, I'm proud of you for taking the high road, Tally Zora. But, that is just not the way I like to travel. Maybe we should go have a little talk with that clerk. <laughs> I spent three years waiting to come back and make his life hell. But when I finally saw him, he was just a clerk whose people desperately need help. Which they'll get, thanks to you. Nice work, Ambassador. This war is more important than grudges and prejudice. Maybe he and I both needed to grow up a little. The difference is that you helped when it counted. The difference was you. Oh no, I can't take credit for your growth, Delizora. I still want to go rub his face in it. Everything looks so peaceful. Ah. I mean, it's very smoky, but I guess so. In here, you can almost forget about the war. I never get tired of looking at this place. I never thought they'd let a quarry in up here. They are scumbaggy. The Presidium is so beautiful. I've recovered the obelisk of Karza. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. You have? It's amazing. Thank you, Commander. That's going to help immeasurably with some very sensitive work. How's the translation going? Really? Excellent. Well, hopefully it unlocks more intel from the Archive. Hi. Urgently, human, I must speak to you on behalf of my people. What is it? Holding sorrow, Takuna, my home world, the Reapers have come. Holding sorrow, our warriors are under siege, but your forces can rescue them. Urgently, please, all the other races have turned us aside. How do your people fight? Proudly, with BI-assisted infantry. Our soldiers carry heavy weapons into battle mounted on their backs. Mixed pride and shame, our enemies have called us living tanks, as well as names less flattering. I'll take the Normandy as soon as we have time. Relief. Thank you, Commander. Small hope. Perhaps we can evacuate some of our civilians when your forces arrive. Anxiously, I will remain here for news. Please hurry. Takuna burns. Yeah, I mean, I'll do what I can, despite the fact that you're inconveniencing me by adding more missions to my journal. All right, so since we are here at the embassy, the Asari counselor did mention that she wanted to speak to us in Udina's office. His former office. I want all remaining files secured and marked for Tentron clearance only. Commander Shepard, thank you for coming. Did you find something? The Council has ordered a full review into Donald Udina's activities. We're still piecing together his coup attempt. But that isn't why I asked you here. The situation is growing urgent for my people. We're aware your Crucible is still missing a key component. The Catalyst? Do you know something? Not exactly, but there is a artifact on our homeworld, Thessia, known only to highest levels of my government. What is it? With any luck, it's a means to help you locate the catalyst. The artifact is kept in a temple located at these coordinates. I've ordered a scientific team to meet you there. 
If this artifact is so important, why keep it hidden? Every species in the Citadel has its secrets, Commander. But this one, in the wrong hands, would upset the balance of galactic power. The Reapers are doing that right now. Which is why I'm bringing this to you. Why the sudden cooperation? The Reaper's progress has changed everything. The Matriarchs are growing desperate. For the first time in our history, Thessia is vulnerable. For all our intellect, we're outmatched by Reaper firepower. I'll do what I can. Whether you know it or not, you've become the sole ray of hope in a very dark night. Goddess be with you. Huh. Alright, well, I guess it's onward to Thessia. most of the planet what about the temple can you raise the scientists negative all channels are scrambled across the spectrum the mission's looking really dicey this is too important it's now or never Shepard that's my home down there I have to go then get to the shuttle and let's do this Liara, do you have anything more on this artifact? These coordinates the Counselor gave you are for the Temple of Athame. My mother took me there once. It's several thousand years old. And for some reason, it has classified government funding. Sounds like we're on the right trail. What if we're too late? My people are dying down there. Your empathy is a weakness. You must numb yourself to this. Venezia took you to this temple? I was just a child. I thought it was a history lesson, but now... Maybe there was more to it. What do you mean? I went digging through her old files. She had heavily encrypted records on this place. Some dating back centuries. I still can't crack most of them. Whatever's going on, it's well hidden. I've studied your old mission reports. Your mother was indoctrinated. Yes. We had to kill her. Yet it did not stop you from fighting. As I said, steal yourself. Many more lives will be lost. We can't ignore that people are dying. The Reapers may not have mercy, but we do. It is their indifference that gives them power. Then let's show them there's another way. My home. There's no time to mourn. We're exposed up here. Let's get down. Hey, y'all were the ones carrying on the conversation. I was just listening. I mean, if there's one thing you should know about me by now, Doc, it's that I'm very, very nosy. You must be Commander Shepard. Yeah, I'm I am. It. Outpost Tychus is running out of ammunition. We all are. Tell them to make every shot count. Eastern Perimeter reports they've been breached. Where are the reinforcements? This is Task Force Pandora, requesting reinforcements at Quad 091. Situation urgent. I am the reinforcements. Before I talk to you, before I help you out, I'm gonna check out your situation here. Take a breath and relax. Tell me when you feel something. I can't. There's nothing. What about now? Same. Not like my leg isn't even there. Damn it. Now your doc is going to take care of you. She's going to do everything she can for you. But since you're not going to be fighting anymore, you mind if I have some of your stuff? Keep that barrier going. I can't keep this up forever. Oh yeah, you can. You're doing great. Doing wonderful. Commander, we heard. Ah! Hello. Been breached. Commander, we'll talk later. Get on that gun up there and do some damage. Gun? Better 
Out, you say gun? Oh, I like guns. I got the gun. That's the plan. Enemy targets on the oh boy. Y'all got nothing! Do you want some? More on the way. I got some for you! Oh, hi! How you like it? Ah! Crap! Curran, we've been told to expect you. My orders are to hold this grid at all costs. Shore up the barrier! But our perimeter's collapsing, and I'm getting my people out of here. This is important. We need your help. Well, unless you can give me a good reason to stay, we're not dying for a field of rubble. What exactly were you told about me? Nothing but your name. Mission details were classified, which just means we'll die without knowing why. I know what that's like, but you have to trust the chain of command. We're not even sure the chain still exists. So what are we doing here? We're after a relic inside the temple. It's important. That's what this is all about? One of our outposts has been trying to reach the scientists over there, but we lost contact. Get that gunship moving! Now! I'm sorry, Commander. If your relic has lasted this long, it can wait a little longer. I've lost enough people today. I'm pulling the rest of them out. No! I sent you the lineage of a leader. A warrior skilled and cunning. They are strong in your genes. But you've grown tired of war. You're exhausted by defeat. And now you worry you don't have the courage left to go on. By the Goddess, are you... Find your resolve. This war can end if you do. We're building a Prothean superweapon. It'll win this war. I believe it. This is Lieutenant Curran. Hold your positions. I want a path carved to the temple. Outpost Tychus, we've got people coming your way. Let's make sure the galaxy knows the war was won on Thessia. Make it count. I was here years ago. To see the city burning like this is... It can be rebuilt. Just worry about the next 20 meters. <laughs> next 20 meters of cake. I'm worried about the 20 after that. Luckily, I'm so preoccupied with those 20 meters, I'm not going to be worrying about the 20 after that. Watch it! This has to end! Thank you. Your anger. It will keep you alive. Remember that, because here they come. Staggered approach, try to use cover. Push them back! That was the last one. Then move! Get off the bridge! Oh, then we'll get off the bridge when I'm good and ready. We need to make sure there's nothing worth collecting on the bridge before we get off the bridge. We're still funding missions here, Shep. You know how this works. We've been doing this for three games together already. On that building, we've got fire support. No! Damn them! Keep your focus, Liara. Those things are slaughtering my people. Then I'll bend their loss. Scatter and take cover! Screw that, we're going on offense! We've been taking out the big boy reapers. I ain't worried about the itty bitty ones. Watch the edges. Don't let them get around us. Bring it. 
Bring something to me. I don't want to bring it to you. I'll bring y'all a little something. Hey, Doc, just hold right here for a sec. I'm on it. Good. What's the perimeter? You watch the perimeter. I'm watching out for stuff. Somebody's got to collect our stuff. Javik. These are the guys you're supposed to be watching out for. I told you, I'm watching out for the stuff. Y'all watch my back. Understood. Thank you, Doc. At least one of y'all understands. And Javik, you got four eyes, man. I'm not just pointing that out to point it out. I, I'm making a point. Four eyes. You should be twice as effective at watching for stuff. That door ahead looks like our way out of this mess. Got it. Another new thing to start. It's fine. All right. Let's get moving before more of them come back. You stop screaming. Can't go this way. It is done. Hey, oh, yeah, how those, uh... Those things... Keep screaming after they've already been silenced. Makes me feel like I'm doing an inadequate job. I don't like feeling inadequate. Knock, knock! Anyone home? I still can't face those things. My own people. When we fought the Reapers, they turned our own children against us. I can't imagine that. They assumed we would hesitate to kill them. Did you? What answer would you prefer? None. Let's stop talking about this. Agreed. Let's move on. Knock, knock. My people are still believing in devils. They changed their minds when the Reapers arrived. Can I retract my knocks now? I'd prefer no one be home. Yeah, we'll do that. First. The Reaper is moving on. One less we get to kill. Oh, shucks. I was really looking forward to that, too. Oh, well. Guess we'll just look for stuff instead. Broken shotgun. You see that? We all think this is. Resident Evil. Hey, Doc, you see a repair kit anywhere? Holy crap. For those that... That's the plan. This is a kill zone. Nice shot. Thanks. That's the last of them. Get moving, Commander. Toward the Reaper. It's a way out of here. You have an interesting concept of escape. No choice. You know, you're probably right, Doc. Boy, do I hate it when you're right. Maybe. We could be right with some good news for a change. Outpost Tyke is too far from here. I can cover you. Go! I'm going, I'm going. You don't rush me. Y'all need it here in Lobo Space Fables. That's the last thing you need right now. I'll tell you the story about the Elcor and the Salarian. Are you aware you got a weird protrusion in your wall over here? That decorative? It's kind of throwing off the feng shui of this place. 
never ends. The hell it won't. We get to this artifact and we can all wake up. 50,000 years later. We're trying to reach outpost Tychus. You're looking at it. What about the rest of your squad? They're all dead. We tried punching through to the scientists, but I'm all that's left. What about reinforcements? We had gunships flying support, but things got too hot with that Reaper. They can't chance it. I know it's rough, but I don't see another way in without their help. Have I told you how much I hate this war? Talon Swarm, this is outpost Tychus. Is there anybody left on this frequency? We are in need of immediate air support. Commander Shepard is here. Copy, this is Talon 1. I'm on the way. Talon 5 inbound. Ground targets confirmed. Weapons are hot. Light them up. Talon 1, watch the jamming! Target acquired. I'm hit! I'll cover you from here. Commander Shepard, I've got your back. Let's get you into that temple. Can we get me some resources too? Oh. No. That's fine. Oh! That is very fine. Owie. Next time we go to war, maybe the Alliance can spring for air support. I mean, we could stick Vega in the shuttle. That's an option. Move! Now's our chance! You know, we gotta work with what we got. But then again, if we did that, we wouldn't have the shuttle for very long now, would we? We'd have to space Uber our way back onto the ship. Give me this. Watch out, more hostiles ahead. Commander, more of the dead are attacked. Crap. Right away. Bogey hey, watch this dude Bogey coming up on our right. Him. Yeah, that guy. Javik. If you ain't looking for a third nose hole to go with your four eyes, please stop stepping in front of my weapon. Contact! Owie! Crap! Crap! I could have handled it! So much sacrifice. We have to make it worth something. We will, Doc. We will. There were five billion Asari when this war began. I wonder how many we've lost today. I can tell you the answer to that one, Doc. It's too many. Hey Doc, I noticed there's like some kind of force field in front of the temple. Is that is that dangerous? Because my hair has not been growing in a while. Looks like we're in the clear. Let's get inside. It appears the temple has been barricaded. I don't want to impede its growth any further if I can help it. Let me take a look. It's military-grade encryption. I think I can override it. Do religion and military always mix among Asari? 
No, this is unusual. Especially since few still follow the Afame Doctrine. Alright, good. My hair thanks you. Hey, Doc. What do you know about this place? Hello? Is anyone there? Something is wrong. Your scientist should be here. Take a look around. Maybe one of these artifacts is what we're looking for. Okay. What's this? The goddess of Thames' shield. Legends say she used it to protect Thessia when the heavens grew angry. Our ancestors were probably misinterpreting a meteor shower. It was an asteroid strike. We deflected it. You mean the Protheans? But that would imply a Thame. Is not what you believe her to be. Just keep looking. Oh. We're about to get a history lesson. Could this be the artifact? I don't think so. It's the goddess of Thames' sword. Myths say she wielded it against the jealous gods who threatened our ancestors. They were a race called the Oravoras. Thessia had vast resources. We protected you from them. Are you actually suggesting that the Protheans intervened in our past? It's more than a suggestion. I find it strange your scientists would abandon their own planet. They wouldn't. Yeah, we'll have to figure out what's going on there, but Protheans intervening makes sense. They intervened with humans, too. How about this? A page from one of our earliest religious texts, the Athame Codex. Doesn't look promising. It describes how Athame taught our ancestors mathematics. Before that, you could only count as high as your toes. We took pity. Hey, Javik, I got a question for you. There's some people on Earth that believe in ancient aliens. Let's sell this once and for all. Was that you? What do you know about this? A fragment from the Codex. It's not what we need. It describes how Athame's guide, Janiri, gave my people seeds. He taught them the seasons so they could grow crops. We didn't want you to starve. For something as important as this artifact, there should have been fail-safes. Yeah, I gotta agree with the ancient alien on that one. Doesn't look useful. That's Janiri, Athame's guide who brought enlightenment to Thessia long ago. And you don't see the resemblance? He was no servant of an imaginary goddess. He was Prothean. Oh, snap! What about this one? Another page from the Codex. I doubt this is it. It describes Lucin, a Thames guide who taught our ancestors about the stars. Your species was deemed to have potential. A pity you didn't live up to it. Oh, hey, that's, that's a little harsh now, Javik. They accomplished a lot. Could this be the artifact? I don't think so. That's a sculpture of Lucin, one of the Thames servants who walked among my ancestors, bestowing knowledge. He was no servant of an imaginary goddess. He was Prothean. Yeah. Should have put that together by now, Doc. Another page from the Codex. Not very useful. It talks about a Thames guide granting us the gift of biotics as a reward for worshipping her. That gift involved years of genetic research. I... <sighs> This is almost too much to take. I just take it for what it is. I mean, when your society was young, they put a lot of stock in superstition like all societies do. But now, you know better. And it makes a little bit more sense, right? I'm guessing these are the scientists. Oh, I'm sorry I walked right all over you there. That's my bad. What are we looking at here? A primitive rendition of the goddess of Thame. She's speaking to her ancient Asari followers. I don't think this is the artifact. Another one of your myths that somehow looks Prothean. What you're implying? It's staggering. We were here in the beginning, watching you grow. A Thame was us. Yeah. I mean, that is clearly a Javik. Alright. This is probably what we're looking for. Check this out first, though. It's the goddess of Thame again. You can still believe that, but it won't change the truth. I mean, maybe your name was a Thame. Their throats. What happened to them? They've been slit. The Reapers didn't do this. We're going to have to figure this out on our own. Who's that supposed to be? It's a Thame. Her image became more like ours over time. You mean your ancestors tried to hide the truth? I'm still not willing to believe any of that's real. 
Then why does a thing speak Prothean? What do you mean? There is something here. I can sense it. In this temple? I admit it is strange this place has been so well preserved. Though a thame does have great historical significance, we once believed our gods were separate from the world, looking down on us. There is a universal energy. There's a Prothean beacon here. What? You're sure? It's not something you forget. But why hide it? The answer is obvious. Power and influence. Your people are holding the knowledge of my race for their own gain. That can't be. I can't believe my people would keep this a secret. A beacon like this could explain why Asari are so advanced. This temple is thousands of years old. Time enough to make serious progress. That doesn't make it true. You can't keep denying reality, Asari. Even a small amount of data would give your species an edge. Or are you insulted that your government didn't involve you? The Mars ruins are where humanity got Mass Effect technology. And we learned of it from the ruins of the Inusanum, the race that came before us. It was our secret for centuries. Well, if it is true, the Asari should have shared this knowledge. We might not have been in this mess if they had. You don't know that, Shepard. We don't know what's going on here. I know we don't have much time to find out. The few records I can access talk about tapping into Prothean data streams, reconstructing matrices, none of which I see here. I do. The activation process has begun. By the goddess. Literally. Look around. There must be more of these connections. Incredible. The beacon seems to think you're Prothean, Shepard. It must be the cipher you got back on Pharos years ago. Or it could be the Prothean standing next to you. Hey, we're not fighting over who gets credit here. But it's me. Keep searching. There have to be more connections nearby. There is nothing useful here. The end of the war is near. Find what we need, finish the Crucible, and vengeance is complete. All right, Rushy McRusherson. It's gaining power. Cool. Hey, why don't y'all play with some stuff, too? This isn't a connection. It'll make these connections a little bit quicker if you do. This doesn't appear to be a connection. We should keep searching. I'm sorry. There, another one. It's still not complete. Well, of course it isn't. That isn't what we need. Show me what we need, this then. confirms the Asari owe your superiority to my people. And you owe the Mass Effect relays to the Reapers. How did that turn out? So you do bite. Good. We'll need that. Doesn't look like a connection. You don't look like a connection. The activation is complete. We can access the beacon now. I'm not going to be built for this, am I, Doc? I didn't mean to break your statue. We need to hurry. This place isn't going to... ...last very long. Obtaining chronological marker. Hold. Time scale established. Post-Prothean cycle confirmed. One of our computers. Reaper presence detected. This galactic cycle has already reached its extinction terminus. Systems shutting down. Hold on! We need answers. To, to what, what question? question? The catalyst. We need to know what it is to finish the crucible. A memory of one of my people. I am called Vendetta, an advanced virtual construct of Patrick Van. Overseer of the project you refer to as Crucible. He died fighting the Reapers in the Battle of Tranvia 9. Your remaining time is also at an end. We're all Protheans so grim. What happened to the Crucible in your time? Why didn't the Protheans deploy it? We were sabotaged from within. A splinter group argued we should dominate the Reapers rather than destroy them. It fractured our order of battle. Later, we discovered the Separatists were indoctrinated. 
I always suspected as much. And now we're facing the same problem. Our studies of past ages led us to believe that time is cyclical. Many patterns repeat. Like the Reaper attacks. And beyond, the same peaks of evolution, the same valleys of dissolution. The same conflicts are expressed in every cycle, but in a different manner. The repetition is too prevalent to be merely chance. We assume the Reapers were responsible for the pattern. Perhaps, though I believe the Reapers are only servants of the pattern. They are not its master. So who is the master? Unknown. Its presence is inferred rather than observed. The only certainty is its intention. Galactic annihilation. You now stand at that precipice. There's still hope for this cycle. We need to know what the catalyst is. Trillions of lives are at risk. Trillions of lives are always at risk. But if the Reapers have arrived to end your cycle, this discussion is too late. We can break the cycle. We found your plans for the Crucible. We're building it right now. The Crucible is not a Prothean design. It is the work of countless galactic cycles stretching back millions of years. Each cycle adds to it. Each improves upon it. Thus far, none have successfully defeated the Reapers with it. Then we'll be the first. Tell us what the Catalyst is. Listen to the human. He can be trusted. I detect you are one of us. You are Prothean. The last. I am the final hope to avenge our people. Your mission was known to me. Do you believe this present cycle can deliver retribution? They have earned the right to try. Tell us what we need to know. Very well. If you have followed the plans for the Crucible, I will interface with your systems and assist with the Catalyst too. Indoctrinated presence detected. Activating security protocol. You. You killed the scientists. What do you want? Your attention. Someone would like to talk with you. Shepard. How did you find this place? The archives. Or did your shadow broker miss that one? Show yourself. I promise I won't miss. Stick to your talents, Dr. Dasani. You've helped uncover the key to subjugating the Reapers. Or destroying them. Damn it, Shepard! Destroying the Reapers gains us nothing. How about peace? They're just trying to control us. Think about it. If they wanted all organic life destroyed, they could do it. There would be nothing left. What the hell are you talking about? I know them, Shepard. I know how they think. I think you've gotten a little too close to the enemy. No. I'm saying they've got it right. Why kill when you can control? The Reapers have it right? You're indoctrinated. You're doing just what they want. I could say the same of you. Wasting time on a war that can't be won. At least I'm fighting. Never question my ability to fight. I've been fighting them longer than you can imagine. And don't assume you know me. My methods for dealing with the Reapers are simply more refined than yours. You've forgotten everything you stood for. Cerberus was supposed to be humanity's sword, not a dagger in our back. Poetic, but as usual, you miss the point. The world is more gray than you care to admit. With the Prothean data in this beacon, I can end this conflict, once and for all. You're either with me or against me. There's nothing gray about that. No, I suppose there isn't. Leng, the commander has something I need. Please relieve him of it. And then bring me the data. Understood. Excuse me, guys! I've been hit! Cover me while I recharge! I got a ninja whose butt needs kicking. Get to cover! Owie! 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 Ooh, that was painful. But we're fine. I've got this! I need to recharge. Cover me! The gunship's taking up positions! Owie! Shepard is fine. You've had your fun now, Shepard. The 
There's only one way this ends. Target the supports. Cerberus thanks you for all your hard work. This is Shepard. Give us your location. I repeat, is anyone on this frequency? We read you. Give me your location. The lieutenant's down. Our whole zone is collapsing. What happened to Shepard? Did they make it to the temple? I saw them. Wait, I've got a read one about. Please, is anybody there? Wait, oh, goddess. No! Commander? Counselor. The mission. We've lost the contact with the Earth. It's gone dark. How soon will the Crucible be ready to deploy? Counselor. I wish the news was better. We didn't get the information. What happened? Cerberus was there. We were... We were defeated. We don't know how to finish the Crucible. I... I don't know what to say. What was the situation on Thessia? Deteriorating fast. The Reapers are there in strength. Then you'll excuse me. There are... Preparations to make. Continuity of civilization to consider. I never thought this day would come. None of us did. I'm... Sorry. Asari forces are in full retreat. It is no longer safe for us to remain in this system. Get us out of here. Shepard. Nobody could have predicted Cerberus would reach Thessia before us. It's my job to be prepared, no matter what. 
And now Thessia is lost, as is the data on the catalyst. I'm sick of Cerberus beating us to the punch. Let's kick them in the balls first for a change. I'm with James. Anyone know where they're hiding? Anyone? Um... Well, there is something. Let's hear it, trainer. I was able to track Kai Leng's shuttle through the relay and extrapolate his destination. But the signal disappeared in the Yera system. Naturally. It's not just gone, though. The signal is being actively blocked. How? I'm not sure, but something is interfering with all signal activity in that region of space. Commander, the Yara system is home to Sanctuary and little else. Sanctuary is a supposed safe haven for war refugees. You think it's worth checking out, trainer? Yes, sir. I do. If Specialist Trainer hadn't examined the data so astutely, the interference would have been undetectable. Nice work, Trainer. You've given us a shot. Now let's make sure we don't waste it. I was stationed on Horizon in the Yura system. You were the only Cerberus presence while I was there. It's a slim lead. Let's hope it's the right one. I don't care how slim the leads are at this point. We've come too far to let Cerberus stop us. I want that Prothean data. I want the catalyst. No excuses. Dismissed. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. Thank you, trainer. Did he sound mad? I bet he sounded mad. Shepard, I heard about Thessia. We were so close, Anderson. So damn close to ending this war. You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? I knew going in there wouldn't be a minute of this war that was easy. But watching Thessia fall, and knowing it was my responsibility... Shepard, you know how many times I got my ass handed to me over the years? Surviving the first contact war back in the day was a goddamn miracle. They said I was a hero. I just felt lucky to get out alive. So maybe Kai Lang did beat you. What of it? It could cost us the war. These guys in the Resistance, they know it's a losing proposition. They know the chances of seeing tomorrow are slim to none, but we all signed up anyway. Hell, I'm sitting in London right now staring at rubble. I was born here, and it's looking like I might die here too. So I say point us at the Reapers and we'll take our chances. You'll make it, Anderson. And when this is all over, you can show me London. <laughs> it might need a new coat of paint first. This will be over soon. It better. Shake this off, Shepard. I will. Anderson out. Well, this isn't exactly how I thought we'd be ending this episode. Taking a loss, you know? Especially at the hands of that stupid ninja magician. That's fine, we'll come back. We always come back. After we took down that Reaper on Rannock. I don't know. Yeah, but there's no way we could have stopped every Reaper on Thessia. The Asari should have jumped in earlier. No, we're not playing the blame game right now. Commander, Cerberus has attacked a comp facility on Onteron. I've updated the galaxy map. Good work. Thanks for listening, Commander. It was a good idea. And right now, it's the best lead we've got. In any event, good luck. Commander? All right, let's go ahead and start wrapping things up here. Evacuating Thessia from Asari Military Command. Good, you opened this message. This isn't actually Asari Military Command. They're busy tending to what's left of their planet. So you survived our fight on Thessia. You're not as weak as I thought. But never forget that your best wasn't good enough to stop me. Now an entire planet is dying because you lack the strength to win. The Legend of Shepard needs to be rewritten. I hope I'm there for the last chapter. It ends with your death. Kai Lang. Oh, this, this, this ninja magician wants to taunt me, huh? As I recall, I was kicking his butt pretty handily, and then he had to go get a ship to blow up the whole place, and the only reason I lost because I slipped. Down a hole. If we 
don't finish that crucible soon, there won't be a galaxy left to save. So Thessia, huh? I guess the Asari are wishing they had fewer dancers and more commandos right about now. Too soon? In case you hadn't noticed, we just lost a few million people. This isn't the time! You see this? Tip tree. Little colony out in the ass end of nowhere. My dad lives there. So does my sister. Reapers rolled in about two weeks ago. So you can assume that I'm generally aware there's a war on Commander. So why the jokes? Because Edie says that according to your armor's metabolic scans, you're under more stress now than during the Skillian Blitz. Like more than Elysium, where it was pretty much you versus 10,000 Batarians trying to kill you. And the last time I had a briefing with Anderson, he told me to take care of you. The guy leading the resistance on Earth is worried about you, and I'm supposed to help. I appreciate the thought, Joker, but I'm fine. The hell you are. You're like half robot at this point. No offense, Edie. And it's my fault. When the Collectors blew up the first Normandy, you died because I wouldn't leave. Because you had to come back for me. Couldn't leave the best pilot in the fleet behind, could I? Yeah, well, I guess that would have looked bad on your report. Come on. We've got work to do. Listen, Joker, that was a heck of a guilt trip. But your jokes aren't funny. Commander? Shepard, I have a question about human behavior. This isn't the best time, Edie. Perhaps humor? A penguin is driving through the Arizona desert. I'm not in the mood. A lively rendition of La Marseillaise? No. Very well. I will maintain a respectful silence until you indicate otherwise. Good. You may be waiting a while. Shepard, this wasn't your fault. It's not about fault. I was supposed to stop them. You will. I don't know if I can do this, Tally. Earth, Palavin, Thessia. I'm risking everything to build the Crucible, and I'm not even sure what it does. Who am I to make that call? You're the one who was right, all along. You fought when no one else would, when nobody else believed you. And if that's not enough, you're the man I love. Don't forget that, no matter what happens. I'm sorry, Shepard. You all right? I'm fine. Liara? I don't know. Okay, I'll talk to her. Thanks. This isn't something she should deal with by herself. Same goes for you. Sure. I guess we know what Liara's going through. Just thinking about Earth, you know? What a waste. Dr. Tassoni has gone to speak with the Prothean. Thanks, Robot. Any word from your family? They made it off Palavin. It was tight, but they're okay. We'll take every scrap of good news we can get. I wish I had more, though. Why? I just had to make a tough call with the Primarch. He said our fleets are being decimated, so I advised him to cease all offensive operations against the Reapers. A full retreat? The only way to save Palavin now is to hold our ships back for the Crucible. But if I'm wrong, then a lot of other Turian families won't be as lucky as mine. That's a hell of a gamble. No other options? If there are, I can't see them. It all comes down to the Crucible now. And ruthless calculus. <sighs> How are you holding up, Shepard? This all has to be taking a toll. It's nothing I haven't seen before. True, but not like this. It's sovereign times a thousand. We won then. We'll win now. Not something you can ever get used to. Seeing a world go down like that. Thousands of years of civilization on fire. But it wasn't your fault. Thessia was already gone by the time we got there. And maybe the elusive man did win one, but so what? I've lost a few fights in my time and I'm still here. It's because I always made sure that a battle doesn't make a war, Shepard. We're still in this. Have you checked on Liara? She must be devastated. That's not something you ever forget. Yeah, I'm, uh, head down there. Shepard, 
This is when you take all your anger and frustration, bottle it up, then use it to rearrange every molecule in Kai Lang's body. You'll get your chance. Have you found your story on Thessia yet? No. I'm trying to word it right. What happens if you word it wrong? If I'm lucky, the Citadel Stock Exchange drops 2,000 extra points. And if you're unlucky? I don't know. I've never really been unlucky. Nothing to report, Commander. Hey, where are, where are these two? You finally get sick of them, kick them out? I don't blame you. Oh, hello, Commander. Ugh. We were just uh, double checking the thermal ducts. I'm sure you were. Carry on. Commander? Shepard. Yeah, how are those thermal ducts looking? Do you think Shepard noticed? I'm sorry, then. I'm so embarrassed. What? Y'all say something? Y'all talking about me? I heard my name. What'd you say? Commander? Shepard. Alright. Must be my imagination. Those were all lies back there. They were not. My people weren't animals for your kind to experiment on. You wanted to know more about your history, Asari. Now you do. I have a name. It's Liara Tassoni. And I'd hey, settle down. My home was just destroyed, and all he can do is gloat. Hey, I didn't hear any gloating. It sounded like he was just clearing up some misconceptions, but knowing you two, I'm going to take your word for it, Doc. Javik, apologize. Given what's happened today, I think you owe Liara an apology, Javik. Apologize for the truth? For not doing more. You're a Prothean. You were supposed to have all the answers. How could you not stop this from happening? We believed you would. Long ago, we saw the potential in your people. Even then, it was obvious. The wisdom, the patience. You were the best hope for this cycle. So you were guided when necessary. Well, it didn't work. You're still alive, aren't you? Your world may have fallen, but as long as even one Asari is left standing, the fight isn't over. I guess that goes for Protheans, too. Despair is the enemy's greatest weapon. Do not let them wield it. Liara Tassoni. That was unexpected. Thank you. We still need her talents. If grief overcomes her, she will be lost to us. So did you actually mean what you said? Does it matter? Liara's been a good friend to me. It matters. Then I will tell you what you want to hear. I meant what I said. Carry on. Trying to keep morale up around here, bud. It was good to see another of my kind. Even if he was just a ghost. One more Prothean fights the Reapers. If there is to be victory in this war, it will be for all cycles. The living will avenge the dead. And do not concern yourself with Thessia's fate, Commander. The loss of a planet is insignificant next to the loss of the galaxy. I suffered many defeats in the last war, Commander. Let this loss be the fuel that powers your rage. How do you see with only two eyes? Evolution has taken a strange turn in this cycle. This conversation took a strange turn. All right. Let's go see if Liara went back to her room. She went straight to her cabin. She's not answering her calm. Too bad. I've never seen Liara like this. Not even after Noveria. Damn. Can you talk to her? You've known her as long as any of us. And with Palavan. I'm just another damn reminder of how many people are dying. You should talk to her. I just regained my homeworld. She just lost hers. Well. I don't have any magic words. She needs time. Maybe call her later. She went straight to her cabin. I'll She's go talk to Liara. You're a good friend. Yeah, I try. That's the bathroom. I try. Yeah, Doc's been a good friend to me too. I've studied Protheans my entire life. If I'd been shown the beacon on Thessia earlier... You would have needed Shepard's cipher to comprehend it. I still could have learned from it. Instead, my mother hid the galaxy's most important archaeological find from me. 
It must have been such a joke to her when I became a Prothean researcher. The penalties for withholding Prothean technology are among the harshest in Council space. Your mother's motives may have been simply to shield you. Perhaps. Thank you, Edie. I hadn't considered that. Hey, Doc. Feel like talking? How did this happen, Shepard? My entire civilization. The Asari's history. The Protheans made it a lie all along. And I abandoned my people to hunt for the Catalyst. Liara. You had nothing to do with the attack on Thessia. Nothing to do with it? I told those people on Thessia we'd save them. How many Asari died because I demanded their help? None. Shepard, that isn't true. You've been warning your people for four years, Liara. There's not a damn thing you should feel guilty about. If we move fast enough, they'll have a chance to survive this, to start again. We lost Thessia, but we haven't lost the Asari yet. Helping the refugees. That's something I can do. It's something I owe them. I knew you'd think of something. I still need some time, Shepard. But thank you. Hopefully she's doing better now. Thanks for talking to her. Neither of us knew what to say. There's not much we can say, but being there helps. Hey, for what it's worth, I know how it feels to lose like that. I know that doesn't make it easier, but you're just human like the rest of us. If you're trying to make me feel better, it's not working, Lieutenant. Hey, everyone on this ship knows you did all you could. You need to cut yourself some slack. Whatever it takes to get that data back from Cerberus. We're behind you. Whatever it takes to end this. Noted. Sure would have liked to visit Thessia before the war. Imagine a whole world of those blue beauties. One of the wonders of the galaxy, if you ask me. You wanna hit Cerberus where it hurts? I'm with you. Ready when you are. Yeah. Let's leave on that note. Next episode, we're gonna hit Cerberus where it hurts. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, Please be sure to hit that little thumbs up button, that would mean a whole lot to me. And if you want to see more of Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition, please remember to subscribe. But as always, I just want to thank you guys for hanging out with me today, I deeply appreciate it. And until next time, I'm Lobo, and I will see you guys later.